the celebration of Allison and Gay. What a wonderful thing. Oh my God, you are beautiful. It is written, when children find true love, parents find joy, true joy. Here's to you finding true love and joy forever. A good wife is a generous gift. Bestowed upon him who fears the Lord, be he rich or poor, his heart is content, and a smile ever on his face. A gracious wife delights her husband. Her thoughtfulness puts flesh on his bones. A gift from the Lord is her governed speech, and her firm virtue is surpassing worth. So who had ever thought when you all met at Penn State, how many years ago was that now? Many years? Six years ago. Who would ever think that you'd be getting married with all these people around out here in the countryside of Virginia? See, God's full of surprises. To my husband, today is the day we get to celebrate our love with all of our family and friends surrounding us and cheering us on from the sidelines. Today will be filled with emotions and is a day we will remember for the rest of our lives. Let's make a promise to each other. Let's look for each other in the crowd when we need a minute. Let's be present. Let's be in the moment. Let's showcase our love and how lucky we are to have found each other. A letter to my future wife, Allie. Love Gabe. I love you and don't know how to stop. Nor do I want to. It's that simple. It's all we need. I want to lose control. I can't let you go. Our past. People say when you know, you know. Cliche, I know. I never believed it until I met you. The past. We met each other during our senior year of college, a year that was supposed to be focused on setting up our careers as we go into, quote, adulthood. And while we did that, life took us by surprise when we met each other. Something about you made my heart jolt. It was different. I knew there was something special about you, something I had to get to know better. Granted, it wasn't easy, but if you know one thing about me, it's that I'm persistent. Those early years are when I learned so much about you. I learned that you're loving, that you're funny even when you don't mean to be, that you're incredibly smart, and that you're beautiful inside and out. But all those things together, and with having you in my life, makes me feel complete to the point where I now can say to others searching for love, when you know, you know. How did I find a man so humble, humorous, and genuine that made me feel special with his actions and words each and every day? I didn't know how much I needed that, how much I needed you. I will be forever grateful for your drive your consistency and your motivation, as you are the reason we are together today. You never gave up on me, and I know you never will. Our present. Today is the first day of the rest of our lives. But getting here took hard work, and it wouldn't have happened without you. Now we move into the present. It has been one of the hardest years of my life. Throughout those days, you have been my calm, my constant, and my comfort. I want you to know that when life is hard and when you're feeling unbalanced, I will be there to level you, to be that shoulder to lean on, to hold you up. I vow to be the person you can always count on, to lean into, or completely fall onto. I will always be there. 
Marriage is a huge step. It's a whole chapter that builds the foundation of what our future will be together. And there's no one I would rather go through it with than you. I treasure you. I love you with every ounce of myself. I'm so happy and excited to call you my wife. But we, we gather as people who have been connected to Gabe or Allie to celebrate together as their community. You know, a good marriage works because there's a whole cheering section. And that's what you guys are. You're the cheering section. Those who have known them along the journey and are here today to celebrate, to thank God, and to be able to celebrate how God will continue to bless you. you know, we have a God who always loves us. In fact, it says in the scriptures that God is love. I believe the verse is true. Wherever love is, God sneaks in. God stuck into your relationship a long time ago. Today we give a chance to publicly thank God for those family and friends that helped you become the man and woman you are today. And how today as a couple, God blesses you in a very, very special way. So may God's love continue to grow in your hearts for many, many, many years to come. Amen. I can't wait to see where our drive takes us next and what we can achieve in this lifetime we have together. I love that we add value to each other's lives. You're the father of our future children, and I love imagining it in my head. You're a role model that our kids will look up to, just like I do. So now some people are going to see these rings on your fingers. Oh, what beautiful jewelry. When they, people compliment you on the ring, I think the best answer is, you need to see who comes with this ring. My husband, my wife. So today, this is more than jewelry. These are public, sacred symbols. May your fullest blessings come upon them. So you may together rejoice in your gift of married love. Lord, may they both praise you when they're happy and turn to you in their sorrows. May they be glad that you help them in their work and know that you are with them in their need. May they pray to you in the community of the church and be your witnesses in the world. May they reach old age in the company of their friends and come at last to the kingdom of heaven. Amen. I'm so excited for us to have a life full of love, laughter, traditions, and to go to bed each night together with a full heart. You've been like a brother to me. I can't even begin to describe how thankful I am for your friendship. It goes without saying, these two quickly became a pair of forever friends. They're two rare to find, fun, hardworking, family oriented, just truly quality people. May God's love shine through you so one day all the saints will welcome you into the heavenly kingdom. Let the church say, Amen. Amen. You're getting there. May the Lord give a blessing in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. We're so proud of the woman you've become. You are a gem, an inspiration, and a light for all of us to take in. You've always been so kind and generous and amazing, and we hope you take all these qualities into your marriage with Gabe. For those of you that may not know Allie very well, just a few things you need to know. First, she loves a good bargain. She loves to capture the perfect picture and she loves Gabe of course she does Gabe the bromance is real it's real and I'm so excited that today it's finally official we're brothers man. I've considered you a brother for many years but today it's it's official now we move on to the future the most exciting chapter yet. The chapter we will constantly be working together toward. I'm so proud of you for everything you've accomplished and everything we've accomplished as a couple. Gabe, you are the single best person in my life and I couldn't imagine a day in my future without you. I love you. 
from your wife, Mrs. Allison Aquino. Our future. Whether we're lucky enough to be blessed with children or not, I promise you that I'll be the best father I can be and continue to be the very best husband I can be. I'll be there for you through the thick and thin and be there for you every step of the way because I love you and I have no idea how to stop.